Hey friends, I hope you're having a good day. So I'm doing a wig video today. I'm super excited because this is like something different than I've ever tried before. I got a human hair wig. So it is a human hair, short pixie cut, lace front side parted layered bob and I got red and it's a rooted red. This is from a company called E Litchi, E-L-I-T-C-H-I. And I just wanna say thank you to E Litchi for sending me this wig. I'm so excited to try it out. So there is a lace front and I'm going to cut the lace front along my hairline. And I'm also gonna to try to put a few curls in it because it is human hair and you can curl human hair. So let's open this bad boy up. This came with a lot. It actually came with a little wig stand so you can store your wig. Let's open this up. All right, so here it is. Let's take this out of the netting. Ooh, I love the color. This is a really beautiful color. All right, so let's get a good look at it. The hair feels amazing. You can see the rooted areas right here. Let's turn this inside out and take a look at it. So you've got your lace front here, and here is the underside. All right, and so you can kind of see if I put it on, it'll be sort of side parted, and it's got some nice long chunks in the front, which I love. I'm just not patient enough to grow my hair out that long, but I think it's super, super cute cut. So just for fun, let's go ahead and see what's in the box. So what's in the box is a wig cap, which I definitely wanna use because I wanna put my hair under that. I didn't do much to my hair today. Oh, it even came with some bobby pins and two hair ties, which is kinda neat, and the red. All right, so just to let you know, the price is around $100. I'm on the website right now and it says $106.99, and I also have a coupon for this. I will absolutely link the wig link in the description below. And then I have a coupon code for 10% off, which is capital C, capital F, 10. So I'll include all that information in the description down below. All right, let's get started. So I'm gonna go ahead and put my wig cap on, and I'm gonna go ahead and comb my hair out of the way. Honestly, this will help me with the cutting process because it'll keep my hair out of the way. All right, and now for the fun part. You can see the back is really cute. The hair is kind of sort of going under and there is a tie in the back, which I'm gonna try to get going on. Let me go ahead and clip this in the back. Okay, so here's what I'm gonna do. I'm just gonna pull this wig cap so that I can see my hairline. That can help gauge where I do the cutting of the lace. So let's try this again. You really have to work at pulling all of the lace down around your ears. So now you need a pair of scissors. And I look aside right now, don't I? You need a pair of scissors. I've got two different scissors here. I'm gonna see which ones work best, but this is just a regular pair of hair cutting scissors. The best thing to use is some really small scissors like some nail clipping scissors or some little sewing scissors works really, really well. I couldn't find mine, so I'm gonna try either one of these. We'll see which one works better. I think I'm gonna go with these small ones right here. So we're gonna start by taking a sip of coffee. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna do a cut up the center here, kind of like right around the part area. Honestly, you kind of need to pull the hair back. So I'm gonna take these little ties and just pull the hair back. This hair feels amazing. All of the wigs I have bought have not been human hair. They've been synthetic, so you couldn't really curl them. I think that's the benefit of human hair wigs is that you can actually style them. All right, feeling pretty good about that. And I'm gonna go on this side as well. I'm not cutting exactly right next to the hairline, but just a little bit under. So now we need to deal with the ear area. So I'm gonna take this little tie out and put it under the ear. One thing I don't wanna do is actually cut any hair. All right, let's get the right side now. I do wanna say that I am not an expert at wigs at all. I'm just doing this for fun. So if I'm doing something wrong, just forgive me. <laughs> okay, 
So I'm feeling pretty good about that. So I'm gonna go ahead and take out my ties. Ooh, I really love this cut. This is so cute. I'm gonna just give this a comb through. All right, so I'm gonna show you the side profile here so you can kind of get a sense of how the cut is. I had to just do a real quick shave of my neck because my dark hairs were sort of clashing with the bottom of this wig. I don't know about you, but I always have neck hair that I have to keep trimmed when I have a pixie. So here is the right side. All right, so what are we gonna do? I'm really thinking that I wanna put a few curls in this because I've always wanted to try human hair wig and see actually how it would curl. This kind of hair is different than mine. This is quite thick hair, but it is really cute. The color to me is my favorite part of this wig. As far as how it feels on the head, it feels like a wig, which there always feels like something's on your head, but you get used to it after a while. It is a little more snug than the Paula Young wigs that I've tried. Not snug in that it's bothering me, but like it fits harder on my head. You don't have to use the clip in the back, but what feels snug mostly is the wig cap. Ooh, it's a little hot in here. Okay, so I could honestly just go out like this because it's already such a cute style, but I just wanted to try my tool. This is the Callista Faux Blow and see if I could put a few curls in the front here. So let's just take one of these. Oh, it is definitely curling. That is so exciting. So while I'm curling this, I'll tell you about my week. I had a really good week. I started exercising again, started walking at lunchtime. Lunchtime walks are the best. I don't know. It just like resets your brain, lets you get through the afternoon. My husband and I are going over to some friends of ours house tonight for dinner. So that's going to be fun. So this morning I got up early and made some cheesecakes. It's Saturday today and I have a game night scheduled with my kids today tomorrow night. I've actually never tried to use a faux blow on longer hair than my own pixie cut. So what I'm seeing with long hair in this faux blow is that it's a very kind of wavy style that you can get. I like the amount of volume on this wig. The volume is really good. And I know a lot of people when they try wigs, if they're not quite happy with the style, you can cut it yourself and you can always take it and get it cut at a salon. If you spend some money on a wig and you really like it, but you you like it trimmed in a certain way, don't hesitate to take it in and get it trimmed. My favorite part of this wig, I think, is the cut and also that it's human hair. The color is just fantastic. I don't know if I look good in this color, but I'm a fan of this color, this deep red, this kind of like burgundy with the dark rooted. It is just adorable. 